Hi guys, welcome. For today, I want to present to you introduction power platform Power Automate. In this, how to do make a flow to delete page in SharePoint Online step by step. So, what we will do? We will create a new page property in your SharePoint site, okay, in library site page, create instant flow to delete site page based in that property so guys let's do demo time let's see it how to do it so we will like i said for example you have inside your site page site page right so to be deleted this page we must create a colon name it uh, for example, to be deleted, right? So to do that, if uh, a fast way, go to library settings, right? Site page settings, library, and create your colon. Okay, so create one colon, right? Give them the name, for example. In my case, to be deleted, I will create uh, a choice with yes, no. Right, for example, no and yes. Uh, on on tip to you, use for example no by default. If not, you can you can delete for example a page by error in, in, in your site, right? So after that we will see it like, like we saw before the column inside page library right this right as we create the one page for example we can in the page details see it the property we create okay was been created for example to be deleted i will show you a new page for example like page to be deleted to right so go go here i will publish go to the page details for example page details again and to be deleted by default is no right so after that i can choose yes and what will happen is that property we in the site page now we go site content right site page and we will see it that two page must be deleted right so now the the way this is the setup to be deleted right so i want as i put that property to yes must be delete that page so I will go to flow again, flow now, and for example, I will show you this basic flow. In this flow, I create a manual trigger flow, okay, no input, and I put it, for example, the site I want, right? This is the site, right? I put the site and the list name. To put the list name, you must go for example if you for example i will show you if you go here don't show any any lists in the site but you can see sharepoint list name and of course you can put it a default a custom okay is what i did put a custom it is this is the important tip after that we will like you saw here, I will use to be delete, but another important point use to be delete value. Okay, guys, this is important. Here, you must use not the to be deleted, but to be deleted value. Okay, this is from the apply. Okay, in the, the apply to which, right, we are only give you an uh, introduction to, to the flow. Get items, so obtains 
all the, 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 the pages inside page, right? Apply to which is a logic to uh, a loop between all that items. And after that, uh, is, uh, we create a condition, for example, if the value to be deleted, the, the column uh, or the property is equal to yes, we will delete the item. Okay? Like you see here, I will go to site page and delete. And after that, I will send a mail. Right, guys? So I will pu put all of this in the in the canteen.net post uh, delete SharePoint list based in Power uh, SharePoint uh, page based in Power, uh, Power Automate. Okay? So now, after that, you make a save, right? And test your flow, right? So you go here manually and test. After this, we will delete two pages in the site, right? The flow we will run immediately, and after that, we will see, for example, uh, the page two and the page three page are has been deleted okay so if uh, you go to your site now you don't see the page because the flow runs see that page has to be deleted and deleted if you if for example you you want recovery your um, your uh, your page you can go to recycle bin Right, and that file that page as in the recycle. Okay, the recycle bin. If you are if more interested, I will uh, talk in getting.net about what is the recycle bin in SharePoint. So, guys, see you, see you later. Subscribe channel, and I hope this uh, is is uh, a subject of interest to all of of you. Okay, bye bye. See you soon.